एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल माई नेम इज अनुप सिंह यू आर वॉचिंग एरो टेक एडवांस यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द गेट एरो स्पेस इंजीनियरिंग वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस फोर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स सो लेट स्टार्ट दिस वीडियो सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द गेट एग्जामिनेशन रिलेटेड टू एरो स्पेस इंजीनियरिंग टॉपिक इज स्पेशली फॉर एरो स्पेस इंजीनियरिंग सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस फर्स्ट जर्नल इन्फॉर्मेशन सो हियर आई एम डिफाइनिंग इन दिस वीडियो फोर इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस सो लेट स्टार्ट विद हेल्प ऑफ फर्स्ट पॉइंट देर आर टोटल फाइव पॉइंट्स आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस बट हियर द फोर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू सी द फिफ्थ वन इज प्रिपेयर Preparation tips, but I will consider the first four points is very important four points related for those students are giving the gate examination. Those are serious about the gate examination. The first uh, point that is what is gate. The students don't know about gate. Many of the students even are not aware about what is gate examination. So very important to watch my this video to understand all the engineering students to understand what is gate. so the second question is why gate exam so this is a very common questions so what i mentioned in this video the third question or third point is a general gate eligibility criteria so i know many of the students even don't know what is the eligibility is required in gate examination and fourth one is aerospace engineering subjects in gate examination so that is very important that last last one that is little bit lengthy but very important so guys don't skip the videos i am going to discuss at the last because the i am going to give some tips how are related to gate preparation so let's start with first point is gate so try to understand the gate stand for graduate aptitude test is one types of graduate aptitude test and graduate uh, graduate aptitude test in engineering is an all india test authorized and managed in eight regions across the nation so the examination of this gate is conducted by the gate committee and faculties member from iic and other seven iits in our india and gate examination is a national level test organized for aspirant who want admission in master program or admission in phd program so at the top level of college like nits iits or triple iits so there is a so many prestigious colleges are there to want to go for post graduation and phd first you need to crack the gate so this is about the gate so i hope so uh, uh, the students are our candidates are understand what is gate the second question or second point is why gate examination Uh, the gate is there the gate is given but the students or candidate don't know why i am giving the gate exam so let's see why you are giving the gate exam so the job opportunities for me or mtech uh, students graduate are very popular in the market uh, everyone is know but this is you need to first pursue the mtech courses from prestigious university or college so in the prestigious university and college required a gate score or gate rank in order to get the admission so that's the reason you are giving the gate exam second the gate score is also considered by the P psu means government job in many of the government firms the gate score is mandatory and very important for your marking for example isro for example nel hal there are so many government uh, agency are there. are offering the job on the basis of the gate score or gate rank and if you see this examination gate examination will allow you to sharpen your skill and polish your knowledge in order to desired discipline what you are interested and explore benefit of your gate examination to more to know more and one thing is very important those are moving for abroad for higher study the gate is also very required in many of the foreign university so that's the reason you are giving the gate and gate is very important the third point that is general gate eligibility criteria so in this case you can find out that is not required any age limit means there is no any bar in the age limit the students are or uh, can 
candidates are always confused related to age so in this case there is no any age bar there in in this gate examination and second very good news for those are in third year in graduation that is eligible for giving the gate now they are all uh, means uh, the third year students are eligible to give the gate and final year graduations is already eligible so this is a very important eligibility uh, statement those are aspirant for gate examination and the one thing is very important every candidate should keep in mind is that eligibility criteria might vary depending upon the different papers like uh, mechanical papers or xc general category papers so it's depend it's may maybe is going to vary these types of criteria because this examination is handling by different different iits so iits is going to decide some changes according to the paper so this is about the general gate eligibility criteria the fourth point that is aerospace engineering subjects in the gate examination so how many subjects are there in our aerospace engineering program in gate examination so let's see there are seven main subjects the first one is general aptitude second one is engineering mathematics third one is flight mechanics fourth one is space dynamics fifth one is aerodynamics sixth one is structures and seven one is propulsion this all seven subjects contains you can find out in a gate examination a means aerospace engineering examination in the gate so this seven subject is very important in pie chart you can see there are all the seven subjects i have mentioned with the percentage so this is uh, i have done the numbers of papers survey and i have made this pie chart so you get the idea how you guys are going to prepared for gate examination in aerospace engineering so this pie chart is going to give some idea about in which area you are going to do more effort or do more work in in order to get a good score so let's see if you see the general aptitude that is a 50% uh, questions are covered in the gate exam mathematics is covered 12% 20% is going to cover aircraft structure 16% is covered flight mechanics aerodynamics is covered 18% propulsion is covered 16% and space dynamics is covering 3% of the question in the gate examination so with the help of this pie chart you can get some idea how you are going to prepare which subjects you are going to do a more effort in order to get a good score in the gate examination it's not required to do everything in the gate examination only required what's your uh, good or interested subjects mean, means in which subjects you are very strong and in which subjects you are very weak so in that way you can find out the subjects and here in the pie chart i given some hint that which subjects covered most of the percentage questions in the gate examination so i hope so this pie chart is helpful this slide you can see here i mentioned the subjects and core topics so with the help of that you can get some idea about subjects wise core topics so let's see the first subject that is general aptitude in that case you can find out the topic co topic is coming in the gate examination like verbal aptitude and numerical aptitude so this is for general aptitude let's see for engineering mathematics you can find out co topic is linear algebra calculus and differential equations so this is a co topic in engineering mathematics let's see for flight mechanics that covering the co topic is atmosphere atmosphere air airplane performance and static stability so this is a core topic of flight mechanics and fourth the space dynamics covering centrifugal force motion determinations of trajectory and orbital period in simple cases so this is a, a topic that you can find out in space dynamics in subject 5 aerodynamics the core topic is a basic fluid mechanics potential flow theory airfoil and wing 
and compressible flow this is the main core topics in the aerodynamic subjects in aircraft structure you can find out the core topic is strength of material flight vehicle structure structural dynamics in included vibration so that is for structure aircraft structure core topic if you see for propulsion in propulsion first is basic and then you can see the aero thermodynamics of aircraft engine engine performance turbo machineries centrifugal flow compressor axial turbine axial flow compressors radial flow turbine and rocket propulsion so you can find out these types of core topic in propulsion subject so this is a small overview of subject wise core topic so i hope so you guys got some idea about subject wise core topic and helping for your study and preparing for gate exam now the fifth one in this uh, uh, topic that is uh, preparation tips so guys here i am going to give the some journal preparation tips uh, that is not only for aerospace engineering students that is for overall all uh, subjects domain of the engineering students so guys the first step you can see the preparing for gate need time and strategy planning along with implementation but even before that first intro respect yourself of what you are weak in and what you are strong at it is always advised to you the first finish up the part that you are interest you and sections you are strong in so this help to build your confidence and ensure to increase your score in the gate exam for tip number 2 for preparation of gate exam is that to take the take up the section you are weak means which subjects you are weak and first focus about the basic concept and go for advance or higher level and do some practice of the questions if your fundamental are strong then you are fear for the topic we are get away and then you are boost of your confidence in order to crack the more number of subjects for the weaker subjects so that is a, a tip number 2 for gate preparation tip number 3 for gate preparation if you see the keep looking and solving the previous year's question papers to have get a fair idea about what level of questions and what types of questions uh, you can expect in the gate examination the questions may be tested in the form of recall comprehensions applications analysis and synthesis common data questions linked to the questions based answer formula and shortcut tips you can apply it and make that shortcut formulas for every chapters or every topics so this help a lot in the last week of the gate examination when it is near about means its exam is very near so at that time you can utilize this types of tip but solving the questions of the previous gate examinations that help you to understand what types of the questions are coming in in what in in which subject so that is helpful up to but required more work in your interested subjects and weak subjects also in tip number 4 if you see the detailed syllabus and multiple study resources must be with you not skip even a single topic many books have a previous year's question paper along with sample papers uh, browse through them and solve when you are uh, feel 80% of your preparation is done access the mock test uh, result to analyze your weak areas and strong areas and accordingly you can work on them so this is the fourth strategy or four tips for gate preparation in this case you can find out that more and more focusing about the practicing in uh, solving the more and more uh, set of questions and uh, mock uh, mock examination and mock test in order to analyze yourself where you are strong or where you are weak last fifth tip or strategy for gate preparation is maintain study routine and disciplined efforts along with having the gap related to your time and other entertainments so a healthy body and sound mind will let you stay focus means in that case you should have to focus no related to uh, punctuality or sincerity according uh, related to your study and second your health 
so at that time you required your healthy body healthy food so you do a more study uh, and you can do more effort in study and second don't lost your uh, daily routine uh, study because of your some personal engagement and uh, some uh, uh, other entertainment so or uh, in gate preparation required self motivation and self uh, effort required to do a hard work to crack and get the good score in the gate examination so guys this is a uh, strategy uh, or tip number 5 for gate examination preparation so guys i hope so you guys are understand what i have delivered the content related to four related to gate examination and we are discuss very four and five important points related to gate examination i hope so this is hel helpful for all the gate aspirant in order to get a good score or good rank all over in india in order to get a admission for mtech or phd program direct phd program with the help of gate score in good uh, or prestigious university or institute like nits iits and triple iits and iic bangalore so i hope so you guys are understand my content and guys very soon i am going to the deliver the gate subject related content in this channel so guys be keep watch and thank you for watching this video thank you so much